So hi guys, I am back with the Gel Polish Mani. So Born, Born Pretty sent me some products to try out and do a video on my channel. So thank you to Born Pretty for sending me these PR products. And so I'm just unboxing these. Um, this particular one I'm pulling out the box is a rubber base gel. And so this would be good for people who have thin, brittle nails. Um, it helps. Um, this is what I, I mean, I don't use this product, but I do use rubber base gel when I'm doing my builder gel feel. We have some metallic, it looks like spider gel, and this is extension gel. I don't wear extensions. I grow my natural nails out with the help of builder gel and so there are two polishes here and so I do like that they are sealed and so I just opened that up off camera and this is the packaging that the rubber base gel came in and it's telling you um, it's a 60 second cure and so um, it's a rather thick viscosity but it was rather easy to apply so um, yeah I'm just opening these and I will swatch the two gel polish colors and then um, we'll get into this mini And so this color was a nice burgundy wine color. These are not HEMA free, um, but I don't have a gel sensitivity and I don't have a HEMA sensitivity. Hopefully I never develop one, but look how rich and pretty that color is. I thought it was very pretty. And this one is a light, um, almost like a light pink lilac. It's a seven ML jelly nude gel. Um, really nice, no issues again. Um, well, not issues, no complaints about the color. Really pretty color. I. Um, um, you know this is what they sent me and I did open that metallic drawing gel off camera it did have a strong smell um, to it to kind of burn my eyes so I did not end up using that but it was very pretty and so here are the two colors swatched um, <clears throat> excuse me on the swatch stick and so I do have on peel off base coat on top of my builder gel and so I'm just going in and applying the rubber base gel um, again it's a thicker viscosity so I wasn't too worried about it running on my nail um, I did have a little bit of uh, a lot of product on the brush when I pulled it out the bottle and so that's why I'm just doing um, two nails and you'll see me swiping more product back into the bottle and so I'm just applying that trying to get that layer as smooth and even as possible if there's any polish or gel polish that I get on my skin you want to use a nail brush and alcohol to clean that off before curing so after I get all uh, five nails coated I do um, cure for 60 seconds in my LED lamp no issues with the rubber base gel it applied nice And so with this rubber base gel um, after I cuz that these I popped these off the, the next day um I there was something I can't remember if I was on Instagram or TikTok where people would put a solid color on their nail and they would use like a milky white color and kind of put it in the middle of the nail to make it look ombre on the edges and so I was like oh I bet you that would be good to do that so I might come back with another video and um, do something or attempt let me say attempt because lord knows how mercy I, I cannot draw or do a lot of nail art that's why I do stamping um rhinestones stickers and water decals and so again i'm just getting that i'm um, smoothing that out on the nail taking my sweet old time polishing um and so here are all five nails nice milky color kind of reminds me of the builder gel on my right hand and so i'm going to go in i'm going to use two colors i'm going to apply two coats of color to each nail and i'm going to cure for 60 seconds in between each coat and i'm just wrapping a rubber band around the handle i find that i get a better grip on um the handle and also it gives you a little bit of cushion and it's not sliding especially if you have lotion or something like that on your hands and so i'm applying this in thin layers and the first layer it looks streaky but the second coat it all comes together rather nicely
And so you can see, you know, look how uh, pigmented the color now looks with the second coat. I think this color, these colors are gorgeous. They complemented each other well. Again, um, I didn't pick them out. They sent them to me. So, um, you know, nice colors. No complaints whatsoever. Um, I think they looked good against my skin tone. I think they probably look good against any skin tone. So after I get that second coat, no, I don't show all five nails. And I'm just trying to get that as smooth as possible. Um, see, pretty 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 and so after I cured I'm going in with some decals that I got from nail drip custom water decals that company is no longer in business um, as far as I know um, her site is still closed um, so what I try to do here is I wanted to put the uh, leopard floral um, water decals on the middle nail. I wanted to put it on the full nail in the middle and half of the nail on my ring finger, but that didn't turn out good um, because I didn't gauge it appropriately to put the decal on half of the nail. So off camera, I end up putting, um, doing a, the full decal on my ring finger as well. And so with the water decals, anything that's hanging, see look, I, look at that mess. Did, didn't even get the free edge and then it's over like three-fourths of the nail instead of half but you know so i took end up wiping that off with alcohol and lint free wipe come back boom it's on the um second um full water decal on my ring nail and so i cleaned up excess with a nail brush and acetone off camera and so born pretty did not send me a top coat so i'm going in with triple vitamin um no wipe steel top coat and i'm going to apply two coat well one coat to the nails with the solid color and for the nails with the water decal i'm going to apply two coats curing for 60 seconds in between each coat So once I get that top coat on again, I'm gonna cure for 60 seconds. I'm cleaning up any excess. Um, and so guys, coming up is the finished look. Look how nice and shiny that is and pretty. And so you wanna apply your favorite cuticle oil once your nails have cooled off. So guys, please like this video, leave a comment and subscribe to my channel, it is free. So I hope you guys have a wonderful week and I will see you next week. Thank you so much for watching.